Bada boom, bada bang, baby. All right, guys. So, oof, whoops, whoops. What's poppin', YouTube fam? Um, sorry about the awkward angle. I just randomly set up the tripod at a weird height. So, but anyways, in this video, I've kind of already gone over, it, but in this video, I'm gonna explain to you how to get. The looks maxing slash mogger's face. That's right. That right there. <clears throat> There's really two pieces of advice uh, that you can do to get this look. Number one <clears throat> is get insanely lean. Or three, three pieces of advice. This is non medical advice, so don't uh, quote me. You know, this is just anecdotal. Now, I went over this. How to maintain your jawline. That's more for the bulk. This is how to get a very specific look right here. The jawline, cheek line, bone, facial structure. Now, the number one thing is you're going to have to cut. Um, and lose quite a bit of body fat. Especially if you're, if you're fat. If you're fat, you're, you're toast. Um, and obviously, this is not a guarantee that you're going to get this look. Uh, the other thing is it's going to be based on your genetics, so genetics account for like 30% of like all, all things, how your physique is going to look, how your facial structure is going to look, how attractive you are, your mindset, everything, you know, you know how it goes, your personality, uh, well maybe not, now we're just getting nuanced, but anyways, yeah, so cut, you're going to have to cut, if you're fat, you're, to you're cooked, brother, um, it's gonna take you a while before you get the the model look, the the looks maxing face, you know, the the look that the TikTok look. Um, but right now, sitting at about 157, 158-ish body weight, pretty pretty small for me. But you're gonna have to cut. That's the main thing. Um, I'd say eight to twelve percent is good for this look. Um, you'll see most of the models are around 10%. Um, this seems to be the sweet spot. Um, maybe a little bit higher, body fat 12%. Um, I'd say I'm about 12, 13, ah, 13 right now. I got abs, but, uh, nothing chiseled and defined. Um, yeah, I'm like 13-ish percent. High 13, like 13.3, let's say. Um... But I would say for this look, you're, it's going to look best between 10 and 11%. And I'd say that's probably where you're going to look your most attractive for your face, um, is 10 to 11% body fat. Um, once you start getting too lean and losing too much fat uh, and getting anorexic, I don't know why I put quotes there, but when you start getting anorexic um, and really skinny, like some... You, like the models, they start looking freaky, and I just I don't think that look that look. I understand they're it's for runway and stuff, and I don't I don't know the whole thing, but anyways, it starts getting freaky, and it actually um, takes away from your natural face structure. A little bit of fat will help you look good, um, and it'll help you achieve this look. Um, and then, third tip is growing a beard. <laughs> may or may not help. Um, if you can, or any facial hair, I wouldn't say a beard, I, I just have a uh, scruff. Allowing right here, your facial jawline slash cheek hair to go perfectly in line, I think mine's a little bit high. Mm, I'd say it's at a good height. Like I said, this is anecdotal and kind of what I think, but lining it up perfectly right there where your mouth and then like, not your temple because your temple's right here, but the top of your cheekbone right here, allowing, if that even makes any sense, lining your beard up right there is going to... Like, I even now, I'm super anal about it, and I just put, <laughs> um, I use a comb from, like, right here to mount my lip, the middle of my lips, and then 
perfectly. You get a nice even line right there. And that'll really help accentuate. But I'd say uh, the beard could occur, could or could not help. You obviously see all the guys that go like that, and they don't have any facial hair. So you got to try both looks, see what works for you, see what you like. Um, obviously, this isn't going to attract women. It'll probably end up actually uh, uh, pushing them away or whatever. Uh, they probably won't even like this. This is just for your own, I guess, self-absorption and self self uh selfishness i guess so <clears throat> but that's all the tips i can really give on this um just got back from cancun so we'll be coming out with that vlog i got a cardio podcast i gotta post i got a lot of stuff i gotta post got some unboxing videos i gotta do for you all um so i have about four or five videos in the works uh I just gotta get started, so I'm just gonna get started with this one, baby. So, see you all in the next video. Um, probably do the Cancun vlog slash back workout. I have like five videos. I just realized I am behind on my posting. So, <clears throat> a lot of stuff coming your guys' way. Hopefully, every three days I can get a video out and whatnot. Um, and blow this thing up. Keep you guys updated on the uh, comp. Yes, I'm still doing competition, so. But, oh, and by the way, I got, that's right, baby, we going country style, um, and, uh, yeah, so I got the cowboy hat, been wanting to go on for a little bit, so, country club, here we come, um, alright guys, I'll just see you in the next video.